good morning welcome to the channel it's eight i'm sorry it's 7 52 and we just arrived at odessa golden gate and tracy we're gonna go ahead and deliver this audi that we picked up yesterday in sacramento it's 10 05 and we just made it to town motor company in redwood city we're gonna go ahead and pick up a ford fusion and this vehicle is gonna go to pleasanton so i have to go to the service i checked in the dealership they told me to go to the service for the vehicle. I found the vehicle in their lot and their lot is very small entrance so we have to park on the street. Not much parking here but luckily we only have one vehicle. We're going to quickly load this up so we can get vehicles loaded. He's going to quickly strap off four wheels. I already took photos while he does that. I'll walk around the vehicle, write, jot down any issues, and we'll get out to San Jose. It's 11 a.m. and we just made it to Stevens Creek Chevrolet in San Jose. Here we're going to pick up three Chevy Volts that are going to Pleasanton and Modesta. We have the keys to all three Chevy Volts. Now we are going to go ahead and drive to their storage lot and pick up the vehicles. They said it's five miles from here, so it shouldn't be bad. 11.35 and we just made it to the vacant lot. He's going to go ahead and unstrap that vehicle and unload it. Meanwhile, I found the three, the three volts. I'm going to take photos and jot down any issues. By then, he should be unloaded, and then we'll go ahead and load these. It's 1140, and two vehicles are loaded. We have two to go. These two vehicles, along with this one, will be our next stop in Pleasanton, and then this vehicle there is going to Modesto. So, although we loaded it there, had we loaded it in this first position, he'd still have to move it. He's going to go ahead and strap off all the wheels of these. Two. I get in. Now it's important before you drive in to the third position or someone drives in that you put those safety bolts there that he's about to do on both sides. That'll make sure that the, the ramp doesn't accidentally fall. And he's gonna go ahead and do the other side as well. Nice thing about the Kaufman Easy 4, other than the ramps not being very steep, is I always are I'm always able to get out of the, the driver's side door and I never have any issues. With some other trailers, there's issues sometimes getting out of the driver's side door. It's 1152 and all vehicles are loaded. He's gonna go ahead and finish strapping all tires. And we are gonna go ahead and head out to Pleasanton to deliver three, then to Modesto to deliver one and pick up two. Like I said in the video, these are the safety for the ramp and these should always be put in place on both sides prior to driving inside the third position. Again, he uses these wheel shocks anytime he's loading and unloading vehicles. That way it doesn't put too much pressure on the truck, on the brake system of the truck. He's gonna go put that away. He always uses one cone when he stops just as a hazard precaution. So highly recommend him. We just made it to CarMax in Pleasanton and it's super busy. They have three trucks there, another truck down there, a tr two, two trucks there, and we're 
here. So we're gonna go ahead and unload the vehicles here. And another one, I see another truck over there. So three, four, five, six, seven, with us it's eight. We're gonna go ahead and unload the vehicles here. I'm gonna park them over there and wait for our turn to check in. Let's see how long this takes. Cars. Now I'm gonna go ahead and park this last car and check in, get in, make sure that they know that I'm here. Meanwhile, he'll go ahead and reload that vehicle and strap it down. 25. All three vehicles are here. I have the keys, of course, are locked up. Now I'm gonna go ahead and check in at CarMax. Let's see how long this takes. 35. Another transporter is just right there, and there's another one there. Like I said, super busy. 48, and we just checked in all the. One more car we gotta pick up. We just checked in the three vehicles. It helped a little that we were we volunteered to help them drive into their lot. So now we're off to Livermore to pick up a vehicle that's going to go to Odessa and Tracy. And we just arrived at Audi and Livermore. We're going to go ahead and pick up one vehicle and this is going to go to Odessa and Tracy. Hey, over there, a few blocks, two, three blocks, but they parked this vehicle under Porsche. Now we're gonna load it up and take it to Odessa. This is an Audi Q7. And it's a cute little car. It's 2.30 and we just loaded the, the Audi. And like I said before, the Audi is going to Odessa at Tracy and I believe we're gonna keep the Volt overnight because we have two pickups tomorrow in Modesto. So uh, we'll continue that tomorrow. and we're right back where we started this morning at Odessa, Golden Gate and Tracy. And like I said before, I'm gonna go ahead and drive in these, this Audi and I, we will be done for the day. We will continue with that car tomorrow morning. While I drive in the car, he's gonna go ahead and put his straps away his cabinets when I come out he should be ready to meet you Audi's delivered and it is pretty empty here at Odessa the sold lot is pretty full but I've seen all of this middle section full in the past all this full as well these are the lanes where they they're bringing in cars and it's pretty empty as 325 looks like he's ready to go 